in this video we have been given that x power x is equal to 2 power 3x plus 192 then we have to find the value of x so we have x power x is equal to 2 power 3x plus 192 and x power a plus b it is equal to x power a times x power b. So x power x it will be equal to 2 power 3x times 2 power 192 and x power a times b it is equal to x power a power b so x power x it will be equal to 2 power 3 x it will be 2 power 3 power x times 2 power 192 and x power x it is equal to 2 power 3 is 8 power x times 2 power 192 and x power x by 8 power x it will be equal to 2 power 192 and a power x by b power x it is equal to a by b power x so x power x by 8 power x it will be x by 8 power x that is equal to 2 power 192 and we have x by 8 power x is equal to 2 power 192 and if we raise both side to the power 1 by 8 then x power a power b it is equal to x power a times b so it will be x by 8 power x times 1 by 8 it is equal to 2 power 192 times 1 by 8 and 8 times 24 is 192 so x by 8 power x by 8 it is equal to 2 power 24 and now 24 it is equal to 2 times 12 and 3 times 8 and 4 times 6 so 2 power 24 it will be equal to 2 power 2 times 12 that will be equal to 2 power 2 is 4 power 12 and 2 power 24 it will be equal to 2 power 24 is 3 times 8 and 2 power 3 will be 8 power 8 so we get x by 8 power x by 8 is equal to and 2 power 24 it is 8 power 8 so if we compare both side of the equation then we can get x by 8 is equal to 8 that means x is equal to 64 so it is our one of the solution and for other solution we have x by 8 power x by 8 is equal to 8 power 8 and suppose y is equal to 
x power x then ln y it will be equal to ln x power x and ln y it is equal to x times ln x because ln a power b it is equal to b times ln a and now if we differentiate both side with respect to x then d by dx of ln y it will be equal to d by dx of x times ln x and differentiation of ln y it will be 1 by y times dy by dx it is equal to and d by dx of u times v it is equal to u times dv by dx plus v times du by dx so it will be x times and d by dx of ln x it will be 1 by x plus ln x times d by dx of x will be 1. So 1 by y times dy by dx it is equal to x by x will be 1 plus ln x. So dy by dx it is equal to y times 1 plus ln x. So for maxima or minima dy by dx it should be equal to 0 and dy by dx it is y times 1 plus ln x it should be equal to 0 and y is x power x times 1 plus ln x it should be equal to 0 and x power x it cannot be equal to 0 that means 1 plus ln x it should be equal to 0 so ln x it will be equal to minus 1 and x will be equal to e power minus 1 that is 1 by e. So, for y is equal to x power x, the graph will be like this. At x is equal to 0, y will tend to 1 and at minimum value of y, x will be 1 by e. It is y is equal to x power x. It is y versus x graph. But we have y is equal to x by 8 power x by 8. So, the graph will be like this. At x is equal to 0, y will tend to 1 and at minimum value of y, x will be equal to 8 by e. And we have x by 8 power x by 8 is equal to 8 power 8. So, when y is 8 power 8, then there can be only one value of x that is 64. So, there will be only one solution. 
सो एक्स इज इक्वल टू सिक्सटी फोर एक्स इज सिक्सटी फोर 